Hello, Fort Mill High School. This tutorial is going to tell you how to request a, call a transcript for your college through Naviance. Let's get started. There are a couple of different ways that you can do this. If you already have gone through Naviance and you have all of your colleges listed under colleges I'm applying to, you can skip a couple of these steps, but we're going to walk you through the whole process in case you want to add anything else. So under my favorites, you're going to see there's colleges I'm applying to and colleges I'm thinking about. The other place that you can access that is up here under colleges, colleges I'm thinking about and colleges I'm applying to. So let's say that we are going to look for York Technical College. I'm going to show you several of the other universities as well. And we're going to type in York Technical College. One of the things to make sure that you are very careful of is as you are entering York Technical College, you want to make sure that you are selecting the one that is located here in Rock Hill, South Carolina. You don't want to, and the same will go for any of the colleges that you are applying to. Some of the schools that are listed in here might have the same name of that college, but in a different state, that there might be another York Tech. So just be aware that you have that location is in the correct place. So over here on the left, you're going to select your technical college. The other thing to be aware of, say, for example, that you wanted to apply to USC Lancaster instead of USC Columbia. If you searched for University of South Carolina, there are going to be multiple listings for the different campuses that are there. So just be aware of that as well, please, as you are requesting that. We don't want to end up sending a transcript to the wrong college and not know why the colleges are receiving the transcript that we thought that we had sent. So go ahead and select the button, the box next to York Tech, and then your actions, you're going to click on favorite, and that will add, you can see up at the top, one college successfully added to your thinking about list. So you can now go to colleges and then colleges I'm thinking about. So any of the colleges that you might look at or might be interested in going to are gonna be listed here. You're gonna see, um, we'll talk more about delivery type. That's gonna be, is it common application? Is it direct to the institution? Is it unknown? You're gonna have different information about deadlines. So to add this and to request that transcript, to add that college to your application list, you're gonna again, click on the checkbox right here next to York Technical College, and then we're going to click on Move to Application List. So the for York Technical College, your decision, your application deadline at York Tech is going to be rolling. If you are applying to a different school, you might have an early action, you might have a regular decision, there might, there are different deadlines here. So please make sure that as you are putting that deadline in, that's going to help your counselors know and help you keep track of what are the deadlines for everything to be submitted. You're going to be able to include that um, and indicate that under that application deadline. So we have rolling the application here for York Tech. The application type is going to be direct to the institution. For other schools, you might be applying by the Common App. If you are applying to the co with the coalition application, you're going to select I don't know or direct to the institution because Naviance and the Common App, those accounts will sync and we'll have another video on that, but your the coalition application does not sync directly to Naviance, so you would want to select that direct to institution or other. If you've already sent your application, you can click on this button here. If you have not, that's okay, you can leave it blank. So you can either click on Add Applications or Add and Request Transcript. When you get to the point, this is where you're going to say what type of transcript you're requesting. So that initial transcript, that's the one that you want to request in the fall. For your mid-year, that would be after the first semester. If a college wanted to see your updated grades to make sure that you're continuing with the standard of grades that you had before and the rigor of your courses, they might request that mid-year transcript. And then final, you would come in and you would request that final transcript at the end of the year for that college that you have decided to attend. Your test results, we do not send those through Naviance. So even though it has those unofficial SAT or ACT scores, don't click on that. And even if you do click on it, we are not able to send those via Naviance. You would need to go directly to the college board or the ACT website in order to um, submit those test scores. So then you're going to click on Request and Finish. 
and under your colleges that I'm applying to, you can see that in this mock demo account, we have requested transcripts go to York Tech. We have requested transcripts go to the University of South Carolina. You will see that there also are a couple of other places that we've requested transcripts. I'm going to show you if you've added colleges to the list but didn't add request a transcript. If you click on this button for College of, Charles, College of Charleston and click on Request Transcripts, you're going to go through that same process. So we want the initial transcript. We're not doing test scores and then request and finish. So the other thing that you can do under um, your Common App account, if that is the way that you're applying, is that that Common App account, in order for the counselor to send the transcript, it will have to be matched to your Naviance student account. We'll have another video on that to walk you through that process, but please make sure that you have that matched. You have to have completed your application for the particular college for it to match between Common App and Naviance. If it's not matching, go back and double check to see if there is another um, step that needs to be completed on those applications. So to for College of Charleston, we've, we've requested all of these transcripts. If I want to see the status of those, I'm going to click on Manage Transcripts here. And that's going to bring up all of the different transcripts that I have requested. So you will see confirmation numbers that you will be able to, once the counselor has sent that transcript, this is going to change from pending to submitted. And that is one of the ways to check to see if things have been completed. A college might tell you that they have not received your transcript. Check here first to see if it's been mailed. And then you can let the college know that that has happened. If you have any questions, please reach out to your counselor and good luck.